Myself, I'm pleased to be here this evening and uh, for those of you who don't know me and haven't spotted the family resemblance, I'm Andy's brother, Simon. Uh, this is my co-best man, Christopher, and uh, we've known Andy, I've obviously known Andy all my life. <laughs> Christopher has known Andy for in excess of 15 years. So in, the, in that time, growing up together, uh, we've learned a lot about Andy and we're now trickling towards our 40s and uh, we've had some good times together. So it's traditional for the best men to, to let the bride's parents know what sort of a man their daughter is married. <laughs> <laughs> or when it's a bit too late. <laughs> well, let's just say there are many stories involving police arrests and orgies. <laughs> orgies of drinks and drugs. <laughs> but anyway, enough about Sam. <laughs> so, about Andy. Well, what can we say? There really is no shortage of material. <laughs> we did, however, promise both families we wouldn't talk about the many stories involving his addictions to sex, alcohol, <laughs> drugs and gambling. <laughs> when we considered those restrictions, we realised the speech would probably much, pretty much end here. So sorry Andy, it's only right we're honest both to Sam and her family. <laughs> so Christopher and I thought what we would do for the next few minutes is just spend a bit of time giving you Andy's CV if you like. Um, <laughs> God. And really like us, you'll probably find it rather interesting. <laughs> so, first and foremost, the early years. <laughs> so picture the scene. As kids, Andy and I, we shared a bedroom together. But pretty much that was it on the sharing front. There was no other sharing because whilst I was perfecting my skills at being a real school nerd, and in terms of other things, impressing our Kayla at Venture Scouts, <laughs> Andy was out gaining his own skills. Um, I'm sure that actually when we tell you about a few of those they'll really surprise you as you look at this smart dressed unsuspecting man in front of you. <laughs> so a couple of the top CV fillers in Andy's earlier years. Firstly horticulture. <laughs> Andy amazed us all by growing his own plants. <laughs> <laughs> However, when the parents found out that the harvest was rolled up and smoked the rock for a rather exhilarating sensation, Mr and Mrs Colvin soon put a stop to 